Yo what is going on people, welcome to another Daisy Tools video. So today I'm going to be showing you how to actually change your cursor. Before we get into it, if you could leave a subscription, that would be appreciated. Also leave a like and if you do need any help, leave a comment. I am looking also for new mods, so if you do have a mod that you want to release, maybe send it, uh, send it me on Discord. Send me some pictures about it. So I'm going to get into this now. So when you first get on DayZ, in the bulldozer, you've got this black dot. Now I've recently re reset, extracted all my game data because actually I wiped my PC. So this is what you first get in armor. You get like a black one of these, a black square. And a lot of people don't like that. So like I say, I'm going to show you how to change it. So it's pretty simple. There's a link in the description where I'm going to give you and it comes up with multiple things. I'm going to show you how to install it. So you're going to download a zip file and when you get that, you're going to have three different ones. Now personally, my favorite is spikes. So what you want to do is you want to open up your DayZ folder. You want to find the actual core folder in your P drive. So you want to go P, you want to go to core in here, it should say cursor. Go in there and as you can see it says cursor.p3d. So what you want to do is my favorite on spike. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag it in there. Now you want to just click F2 on that. Click on that F2, replace that. Yeah, we're going to, I don't know what I've done there, but we'll just, we'll delete them both. Just so it's quicker. Delete them both, move that in, F2, save. Now we're going to go in game. So we're going to click the bulldozer icon up here we're gonna wait for it to load once we get in I'll meet you back up as you can see now we're back in bulldozer and this is my new cursor it spikes it's a lot better let's say if I was to go and find an apple no an apple's a bit too small let's say we wanted something bigger so we'll go we'll get a barn we can place it there go and click on that and if we turn back in, as you can see, you can like grab things a lot more easily. So yeah, that's the tutorial for today. I'm going to leave a like, leave a comment. I'm also going to do a roads tutorial. I haven't done that. I don't know why I haven't done that. It's not done. I need to do it myself because I wiped my PC. So yeah, thanks for watching. Adios, amigos.